of context um, to explain where I just was. I did it. Good morning on Tuesday. Green. We're having some lunch. Yeah. Ryan Little. <laughs> Welcome to January 2019. It's the first working week of January. I kind of went back to work last week-ish. I had a couple of days where I tried to ease myself back in, but we're in the first working week of January at the minute. It's Tuesday. I um, had an admin -y day yesterday, so I thought I would try and do almost like a weekly vlog um i hope your january is going well so far i'm not sure when this is going to go up and i've never done a weekly vlog before so i don't know how it's going to go but is that, on, is that on right yeah sorry i'm putting my jewelry on whenever i start these things i seem to be rushing i have a quiet ish week um it is the first week back so i didn't expect it to be busy but I've got a few bits on, so I thought that to kind of ease myself in to maybe start doing weekly vlogs, that this would be quite a good week to start, purely because, sorry, as you can tell, I'm getting ready, <laughs> purely because if it's an easy one, it will make it, have I got everything? No. Um, it will make it, like, I don't know, uh, an easy one to start with is basically what I'm trying to say. And I'm just going around the houses. <laughs> so, I have a couple of bits on this week. I'll explain them probably as I go. But this morning, um, like I said, it's Tuesday. I have a meeting-ish, showroom appointment-ish. Um, I'm going to have to look in the mirror here. So, I'll just move you around. Um... I have a meeting slash showroom appointment with a PR in central London so I'm hopping along there this morning um and then I'm coming home and then I've got some bits to do I've got a campaign to shoot um general admin bits and then we'll go through the week and see what else I have on but yeah thank you for joining me hope your January's going well and I have to leave now. <laughs> made it into central london i'm walking to my meeting i need to check the email because i'm probably walking the wrong way i should probably do that oh no we're good i'm actually walking the right way for once i am in the pr offices now i'm having a little bit of a look around the showroom oh my outfit goes. i'm having a little bit of a look around the Trace PR showroom, so there are like loads of clothes and bits, and then pick some stuff out, and then I can shoot it for my Instagram. Like a load of different brands. I've picked out a furler bag to shoot tomorrow, hopefully, and um, I'm just going to run up to the toilet. But while I popped into the toilet, I would quickly show you some of my outfit for today. It's not a full length mirror, but I'm wearing the £11 jumpers that I have been storying excessively about for the last couple of weeks and my new new look coat with just some just some leggings and some boots but I will link everything in the description below these are I just don't wear anything else anymore <laughs> just 
been shown some of the pieces from the new Swarovski summer collection for this year and they are so nice they're like all shell pieces look how cute this is so nice and they also have like little charm bracelets and a ring with a shell on a little bit of context um to explain where i just was i was basically at like a showroom appointment so you'll go down you have a look at the brands they offer and you pick out some stuff that you would like to feature so like sometimes you'll get given skincare products and you can try them and then if you like them i'll talk about them on my social media so it's quite a good opportunity to meet people from brands um and to find out more about the brands rather than just kind of getting sent the product and then talking about it it's like it's nice to like learn about the brand know what their kind of brand values are i suppose so you know that you're talking about stuff that you like and have tried and have experience basically for a bit of context because it probably is quite confusing Just got home, haven't taken my coat off yet. I thought I would just quickly show you what I got at the showroom that I just went to. I got a couple of beauty bits that are gifted and then I got a bag which I am loaning because obviously some things are um, higher value when it comes to bags and stuff. So it's quite nice to be able to loan the products and then it's kind of like, um, rental schemes for clothes are quite big now so it's quite nice to be able to loan products and try them out and then photograph them shoot them you know wear them to events and stuff and then be able to give them back and it's quite like it is a slightly more sustainable way of doing this there we go right I should probably take my coat off i'm sweating you're a bit low down <laughs> I did it. First thing I got, which is the only thing that I have loaned um, because it is a furler bag. So it is slightly higher priced than other things. And like I said, it's really, really nice to be able to have this, maybe wear it for like a special occasion and then give it um, back to the PR. It's like a slightly more sustainable way of doing things, which I personally think is a really good idea. So it's a furler bag. It's really, really lovely. It's from the new summer collection um it's a very very summery pink bag it's got their new um like kind of design i would say of the clasp there's a close-up went to boots and i got some eardrops i've got water in my ear or something else but we'll see this lovely ring from Swarovski I picked up so this isn't loaned this is gifted actually I'll show you it in the um in the bag should probably be able to see it better is that hi that is the Swarovski ring I picked up which I think is potentially from um oh god it's so sparkly and so lovely it's I think is from the tarot collection which is the one before the summer collection my stomach is rumbling so much i am so hungry kevin a corn Ke kevin a corn kevin a kevin a corn kevin kevin a corn kevin kevin um this is a new foundation it's like a foundation balm so it's a completely new formula foundation for me to try um really exciting about giving this a go like the, the basic premise i tried to explain it earlier out earlier on is that obviously pr companies represent a load of different brands and they will um give you products to try and then if i like them i can talk about them um and obviously i'm not going to talk about a product that i haven't tried so it doesn't work them saying oh can you do a post for us we'll give you the product instead they say try out these products let you know like let us know how you get along with them and then we can discuss if you want to do posts with them minis from it's called ule hendrickson it's exclusive to boots in the uk if it would focus on them that would be great there we go i think that's right um got two minis this mask is called the cold plunge 
pore mask and i'm really excited to try it i've heard really really great things about this and this is their truth serum which is like a hero product here's the bag on it's from the summer collection so it's a proper summery summery color um and i like i said today i'm just wearing these leather look leggings some boots and a jumper and actually like this is kind of like an ideal spring look for me it's also got the print at the top of the strap as well um really really lovely bag and i'm so excited to have it for a few days plan for the rest of the day is to open these amazon packages i ordered a fitbit because it's january no i'm kidding i'm not doing any weird fitness craze thing i basically want it because i use a sleep cycle app on my phone and i that involves you having the phone next to you when you're in bed and that is like a bad habit that i've got and the fitbit like tracks your sleep and obviously it helps you like make sure you do enough steps and activity and things like that so i kind of wanted to get it mainly for the sleep thing so i don't have to have my phone with me in my bedroom but also um maybe to check the snap check the snaps <laughs> track the steps possibly so i'm gonna open that i'm gonna make some lunch and i'm gonna um do some work about time <laughs> watch other people's vlogs and they're like oh yeah for lunch i'm just gonna have this salad or this meal that i prepared and i'm like i'm gonna have a tuna sandwich with yesterday's tuna sandwich mix <laughs> back at my desk now i've got my laptop and more importantly I have a coffee mm. um and i'm just gonna sit down now and work through any emails that have come in i just opened one and it said your tax return is due so that's <laughs> i'm gonna do it at the weekend i promise uh, you don't care yeah i'm gonna sit down i'm gonna do some emails um gonna write myself up a to-do list it's pretty good yesterday i actually did almost everything on the to-do list except like two jobs um which i may actually do today it's currently actually yeah, it's quite good um it's just 25 past two now so it's still early just have my lunch and gonna drink this bring myself back to life and then i might be able to get along with the jobs that involve shooting some pictures for a campaign um it's for nars which is really exciting i'm just gonna do some admin bits for probably about i'd say half an hour um depending on what i have to do and then i'll come back to you done a tiny bit of admin literally a couple of emails i didn't have much to do because i did it all yesterday because i had a big admin day yesterday so for once in my life i don't have an overflowing inbox i have like one thing which is lovely and then i just tidied up a few bits from today put away the stuff that i got um and now i'm going to set up to shoot the nars campaign with these products down here <laughs> Okay, my lights are set up. My tripod is set up behind me. I have my camera now. This is the camera I use. It is the Olympus, um, I used to use the pen, so I'm getting confused. Olympus OMD EM10 Mark III. <laughs> it's 
literally pitch back outside now. I've just finished doing all of my shots for NARS. I've got to get these swatches off my arm. The jumper, I don't know if you can see, is covered in eyeshadow. It um, needed to be washed today anyway, so it's not too big of a deal. But um, I need to get this off my arm. <laughs> it's a messy job. Um, so, now that I've done that, what time is it? I think it's about four o'clock. Um, I am probably now gonna sit down and plan my outfits and what I'm shooting and my ideas for shooting for tomorrow when I meet Amy and we take some photos. While I was shooting the NARS images, a package from Zara arrived that I ordered yesterday and I'm really, really pleased it arrived because um, I don't have that much to shoot tomorrow because it's January and obviously you have to start again with all of the getting gifted stuff and campaigns and things so I wanted to order some stuff just just to um stuff that I thought would be good for me to have in the wardrobe but that I could also shoot tomorrow and um when I saw they didn't offer next day delivery I was like oh. I, I clicked standard because I was like I want them anyway like just just for me and they arrived they're over there but I'm gonna try them on and um check they're all okay for shooting tomorrow this is the first top i suppose you'd call it more of a blouse wouldn't you it's quite um it's got like this drapey bit on it and because i'm sure it's kind of gathering a bit but is that <laughs> oh my god zara just they just decided not to fill this bit with material i was like what is that oh yeah it's my stomach but i do really really like this i think it's got a lovely sleeve on it i am short and nothing ever fits me like properly on the arm and i think this finishes in a really nice place okay second zara top is on my room is slowly descending into chaos and will be tidied shortly really really love this love this more than the first one which i didn't think i was going to uh it's like um it's got two buttons here so you can actually wear this opened or closed um, I would wear it closed, I think, because I really like a high neck. And absolutely love the sleeves on this as well. Yeah, this was a sale purchase. The other one wasn't a sale purchase. I can't remember what I paid. I think I paid, I, I paid £25.99 for the last one. And I think I paid something in the region of £18 to £20 for this one. Um, and it's, it's a really nice like shirt fabric. It's really, really soft. Yeah. Very happy with this one. Um... It's been ages, it's now 5.21 in the evening. I need to go and have a snack um, and then I'm just gonna plan my outfits for tomorrow, which will be these two tops, a dress, the furler bag, then I'm sorted. Um, so I'll probably leave this here for today and then I will pick up tomorrow when I go and do my shoot with Amy. So I will see you in the morning See you in the morning. Good morning on Tuesday, Amy. Good, Good morning, morning on Tuesday. Tuesday. Today is a shoot day. I haven't started the vlog yet because I was in a little bit of a rush. You know when you just start like faffing yeah. for no reason. But um, we're here, we're at the Ritz actually. Just um, not going in. We're just sorting out suitcases, getting out cameras. We're gonna shoot three cameras outfits today. Battery, Amy's camera's run out of battery, so we'll just fly. Put a brand new battery in it. It's a good start to the day. Um, we're gonna shoot three outfits to do. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Me and Amy have made it to our favourite changing spot, the Liberty Toilet. It's not Liberty. We're not in Liberty, we're in Canada. <laughs> Fortnum and Mason's toilet. However, any department store will work, but these are particularly nice. Look at look at this. This is where you need to come if you need to if you need to if you need to pee or you need to change in central London. This is where you come. It's great. I'm wearing the Zara top from yesterday. This is the second outfit I'm shooting today. Amy's shooting a blue number. We're doing a lot of blue today. There is a lot of blue today. I a lot really of blue like today. We're one outfit down, two to go. It's cold. 
for mac and cheese time. Our weekly ritual. To be honest, we haven't had it in ages. Yeah, we didn't really have it over Christmas, did we? Not at all. Well, I had it once over Christmas. I haven't eaten it in a lot. I've eaten it since last year. Mmm. Very excited for this. We've done quite well today, actually, we haven't we? Have. We've done quite well. Usually we do a lot of um, faffing about when we shoot, but <laughs> we've had no choice. Last outfit now, and then we're done. Woo woo. Woo woo. I'm back at home now after shooting. We had quite a good um, shoot day actually. I was home by about, I think I was back at about quarter to two. Um, it's half two now. I don't really know where that time's gone. We had a good shoot day and I'm back now in some comfy clothes because it's quite nice. When you're shooting, you're outside the whole time other than when you change, um, when you stop to eat, if you do stop to eat. So, you're outside for quite a lot of the time and it's um it's not cold cold today but you are outside and cold for quite a lot of the time <laughs> i am just gonna sit now and do some emails i've got quite a few actually and i feel like people are they've been back for three days now so stuff is starting to come in like event invites and uh, a few campaigns and things like that so i have a bit of admin to do I reckon these emails are probably gonna take about say half an hour ish um, and then I have to sort through and edit the photos I took yesterday from the NARS campaign I might um, I might put them in an email and start to draft an email for when I send them over I haven't taken the other ones yet oh I was supposed to take them today and I forgot it's fine they're not due for a bit um, actually when are they due oh they're due on monday should have taken them today even though today is wednesday i wasn't planning on shooting anymore this week okay i'm gonna have to figure that bit out uh, it's all right i could probably find someone to shoot with oh that's so I thought I had more time. Like I still, in theory, I've got nearly a week. Yeah, I have to sort through and edit the first images that I did for that yesterday. I have to sort through and edit the photos we took today. So we did three outfits, but obviously three outfits makes about two Instagrams per post. So it's like six or so, lots of photos to do. Um, add many things and photo editing basically i have to continue editing this edited a bit of that yesterday and yeah i'm at home for the rest of the day now so not very interesting vlog content yeah i'm gonna get on with this ryan little <laughs> just sat for hours and hours and hours and edited loads of photos and did a few emails and got most of the stuff done that I needed to I haven't got everything done yet but um it was actually a much bigger job than I expected it to be so it's now 20 to 6 I did have a snack in that time so I haven't been doing that the whole time um but now I am going to try out the where is it here the face mask i got given yesterday so i um i feel like i know that's the serum i did show it yesterday that lighting's great yes this uh mask from i think it's ula hendrickson is how you say it, it looks like ole um yeah I'm going to try this out. It's the Ole Hen Ole Ula Hendrickson Cold Plunge Pore Mask. Apparently it's really, really good. So I'm going to try that out now and um, see how it goes. Please don't be alarmed. <laughs> I'm just very blue right now. Or would you call this green? 
so I didn't realise it was going to be this colour. It's insane. Um, I'm going to leave this on for like 15 minutes and see how I feel. The girls in the office describe this as like airwaves chewing gum for your face. Um, I can believe that because my face is really cold right now. The fact that I put myself looking at this on the internet just proves I am way too comfortable with all of this. I'm not vlogging today, it is Thursday because all I'm doing is emails and my new, oops, sorry, my new papier diary arrived. If it would focus, please. Um, new diary arrived, so I'm transferring everything from my laptop and phone diary into this new one which is really lovely for 2020 but that's all I'm doing today I'm doing a lot of admin a lot of editing a lot of sending things over so this is my day <laughs> It's Friday, we've made it to the end of the first working week of January and I'm very pleased about it. I am back in the Trace PR offices, I have a busy day today. I am here just dropping back some stuff and also picking up some stuff and then heading to a River Island event and then I have to meet my friend Robin for lunch and shoot a NARS campaign, the second image. So, busy day and I'll take you along with me. I nearly wore a different coat today, that'd be a miracle. But I am wearing the Zara top and the boots that I always wear. I haven't been very adventurous with outfits this week, I must admit. Yes, so, walking to River Island now, it's like a new thing they're doing called Fashion Fridays, which should be nice, I think I'm getting my nails done. Um, and then heading to Paddington to meet Robin to shoot the NARS image, which I think I've said already, but yeah, on my way there now. Three different areas of London today, in about three hours. Very winter in awful lift lighting. I'm at Riff Rider now. I am here in the River Island offices. I've just had my nails done, which is so good because they were in a complete state. And I did like a full manicure, which was amazing. I was the first person here. I love to be early for things. Oh, look at this. <laughs> um, so basically what I've done is just picked out four pieces. Um, this is all like new in stock and I will probably show you later on what I picked out because I don't have time to try it on because I am in come like mad rush today which is annoying but it's fine it's it's quite nice to be able to like see into the people's offices the river island offices are so lovely and it's very nice to be able to kind of drop in it's like they're designing it like a bit of a almost like a like a drop-in location for like bloggers and things to come in and even like do some work and stuff which is great like i definitely would um come back on another friday and do like sit down and take my time it's a shame i'm rushing today but still i managed to get my nails done and pick out some stuff Moved. I'm with Robin now. Robin's here. Oh, it's really backlit. We're having some lunch in Paddington. We've got this freshly made. Um, oh, it's so bright. Do you think? Right. We're on the move. We're on the move. There we go. That's a little bit better. Robin's here. Hello. We're having some lunch. Yeah. It's really good. It's like a bit bold right now. It's fresh pasta. Yeah. It's great. Um, it's I was nice. like freshly made. 
Robin's got the vegan option. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> She's doing vegan, right? It's not, I do, it's not going that well. I do vegan breakfast for every morning of the year. So that's my contribution. Um, yeah, I got an Uber over to Robin. Now, we found this little cute place with this little metal thing in the background. And we're going to try and shoot my NARS campaign there. We're not going to try. We are going to shoot my NARS campaign there. But first, we're having a bit of lunch. I have arrived home to the most ridiculous amount of parcels I think I've ever seen. Um, I'll show you. I've got one here. Two, three, four, five, six. What? One of these is something I've ordered. The big one is a mirror that I've ordered to, um, it's not actually to really put anywhere. It's, it's just for photos and I'm gonna move it around as and when I need it. So I'm probably gonna put it in the corner there in replace of the, uh, to replace that, that, pr that print. Um, God, my desk is a mess. Not the best, um, thing to show you. But the rest of it, I, um, I don't know what a lot of this is, so I'm going to open it up. I know what some of it is, but I don't know what all of it is. So let's open it up and find out. Okay, here's the mirror. Sorry, I just pulled my top out because, you know, I'm in the house now and nobody needs to be tucked in and ready in the house. Um, this is a mirror. It's actually really big. I don't know if you can tell. I don't know how me going like that would help you tell. But, um... Yeah, I basically just got it for different... I have, like, an idea in my head of a campaign that I want to shoot using this. And um, I thought it would be really, really good just to have a mirror that I can pick up and move around the house to different places to do lots of different uh, shots in. So this is just a really good... Um, thing to have it's actually it's from wayfair um it was about 56 pounds in the um sale and it's it's really really heavy it's really really good quality and i think that's worth worth the money especially soon as i'm using it for work so i'm pleased with that although it means i have nowhere to hide now you can see all my mess all the parcels on the bed and all this <laughs> But it's fine. Um, it's the end of the week and I am due a tidy up um, this afternoon slash evening. So it's fine. The mess will be gone shortly. Miss Selfridge send me like random parcels sometimes and it will just be like a top. But they all know that I will love it. And I do. It's like a, this is like t-shirt material. I've got the wrong bra on sorry um yeah there's just like t-shirt material and then you've got kind of like shirt material on the sleeves just a really good like casual top to have and also like show you in the actual mirror just a good top to, like throw on well we've got an outfit sorted just with this top <laughs> Second parcel was this that I ordered from Papier. Also, look, nails done from earlier on. You can have a proper, proper view of them. Lovely. Yeah. Weekly planner from Papier. Yesterday, I got this delivered, which I actually think I did vlog, which is a um, diary. And I use a paper diary. I think I, I think I did say that yesterday. So this is um, great because I obviously need a 2021. And then I got a weekly planner, which, because um, in my diary, I just put events. Like this is like events and meetings, etc., etc., trips, things I need to leave the house for. And then this is going to be like, Maria, what are you doing this week? <laughs> which I got it to say, Maria, what are you doing this week? Which I'm very impressed with. <laughs> um, yeah, it's going to be for like um deadlines and stuff so like rather what are you doing this week like event meeting event it's going to be like what are you doing this week you need to shoot the nas ad you need to um post this like not a to-do list but more like a what's due what am i working on type thing weekly planner overviews of what's what's due and stuff so lovely stationary things and i think oh they're just so nice aren't they i also have this notebook which i designed the um 
slogan on this myself it's from martha brook stationery suddenly we're doing a stationery haul um it says put your phone down and get on with it maria this has turned into a bit of a haul but um i got these bits sent through from alpha h alpha h make this product called liquid gold it's a chemical exfoliant with glycolic acid and it is incredible if you follow anyone like in skincare communities you probably know what this is it's incredible it uses glycolic acid um which sounds very scary it's a chemical exfoliant it's a liquid you'd use it in the toner step about once a week um well i do anyway and i have very sensitive skin i have very 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 sensitive skin and i can put this on my face and not have a reaction it's amazing and this is basically they so they have liquid gold which is the original and this is liquid rose gold and i think it's in um, a limited edition packaging i got this box of stuff bobby brown which is new um it's the all tied up in lux limited edition lux and fortune collection look at it oh my god what do we have in this box bobby brown extra eye repair cream so eye cream this is their um it's a limited edition collection for the lunar new year and i think also kind of valentine's day it's kind of pink eye cream like they always do kind of like a collection with some special bits and then they do um kind of skincare staples around it so like the eye cream and then the vitamin enriched face base is um a bobby brown like classic i wear a lot of bobby brown on my face um let me think how much bobby brown i have on my face right now um eyebrows mascara I'm looking at myself in the mirror <laughs> eyebrow mascara a lot of the time lipstick not today but a lot of the time uh, eyeshadow i think actually is bobby brown eyeliner both two eyeliners are bobby brown absolutely love bobby brown um so this is one of the limited edition wow you see what i mean it's all like pink and kind of pink and red tones this is a luxe liquid lip rich luster in precious gem it's like a it's gonna be it's gonna be so shiny should we see how shiny this is oh my god you know what that's actually very wearable you know focus looking at the um bottle itself looking at the bottom the bottle itself you wouldn't think it was that wearable of a shade but i actually really really like that you also have an extra lip tint which is the um the lip balm i'm using at the minute another thing i have on my face bobby brown extra lip tint um this is in the shade bare pink Ooh, this is um just like a, a fairly clear one which is um very similar to what i'm using at the minute i think the one i'm using at the minute i use a couple um i have some colored ones for when i'm wearing it under lipstick and then i have um one i just wear as like a standard lip balm um and that's very similar to that so that's great because it's actually i think it's nearly finished oh <gasps> look at that look how beautiful that is the packaging Oh, plastic fell off that's just lovely so lunar new year and i think probably valentine's day is this going to be a red lipstick i hope so because i love red lipsticks now wow oh my god <gasps> look at that looks like, oh no not so bad look how stunning that is <laughs> They've changed the packaging of this as well. They've made it like um, textured. Bobby Brown Bear Glow, different different shade than I have already. I think you can probably use this as, as like a primer. Oh, uses an illuminating moisturizer on bare skin or layered over skincare pat over foundation for a subtle glow. It's kind of all an all rounder glow enhancing balm, which is 
very nice. Okay, last parcel. Um, it's technically not the last parcel. One of the parcels is for um, a Dorothy Perkins campaign, so I obviously can't show you that until I shoot it because it's for an ad. I can't actually remember what I ordered from Suzanne. Oh, and then a t-shirt and a jumper. Suzanne is um, a slightly more eco-friendly, sustainable French brand. Their clothes are lovely. I've had a few bits from them before and posted about them. They go down really well. Uh, yes, so a lovely t-shirt, just like a grey t-shirt with a little design on it. Pretty nice. But the main event, so I, I picked the t-shirt as a secondary thing. Um, the main thing is this jumper, which looks so nice. Like um, a high neck jumper with a balloon sleeve. I will try this on for you now and come back. My room is slowly descending into utter chaos because of all these parcels, but I will tidy it all up shortly. Look, oh my god, look at this jumper. So I have it like a little bit tucked in, but it's a high neck balloon sleeve jumper. Um, it's just, it's so lovely. I'm trying to get you to show it properly, but like you can see all my mess in this room <laughs> from these parcels. Um, look, I love it. I love it so much. Um, it's Friday night. Thank you so much for watching my weekly vlog. It wasn't really a weekly vlog. It was um, a Tuesday, Tuesday, Wednesday and Friday vlog, I think. Yes, it was. <laughs> Yeah, I obviously didn't vlog Monday or Thursday because Monday and Thursday were just admin days. I was literally sat at the desk for hours just doing all my admin and sorting out stuff like that. So it wasn't very interesting. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I know I didn't show you the River Island pieces that I got today. Um, reason being, there is still a dress coming to me because I didn't have it in my size. So I am probably going to do a haul video of all of those pieces. Probably include this and the Cezanne stuff and and some new in pieces that i have so look out for that and why is that flashing red thank you so much for watching and i suppose have a good the battery is flashing and then the memory card filled up thank you so much for watching um i hope you enjoyed it yeah i'm gonna sort out all this mess now i hope you have a very good day evening morning breakfast, lunch, whatever. <laughs>